Alright folks, in this video I thought I would talk about backups. Do we all do enough backups of our precious data? And I'm sure we do have precious data. Hey, family photos is a good example. Business data as well, maybe, if you're a small business. Or Anyway, I had a little uh, problem last night. My solid state disk blew up on me. Not quite as spectacular as that picture there. But nevertheless, it died on me while I was using Ubuntu. It was just nothing in particular on here and <laughs> the whole system just froze and when I went and rebooted that was it, the BIOS didn't even see it. it the whole solid state disk had upped and vanished upped and vanished where? I'd love to know but hey, it wasn't there anymore it was the OCZ Vertex 4 256 gig solid state disk which I bought 13 months ago so just outside the 12 month period that the UK enforces by law So. That was a bit annoying. Anyway, I've emailed OCZ and they've agreed to replace the item. Replacement, fair enough, but it's still annoying. £250 device just gone. I was fairly fortunate I've not lost a huge amount. Um, as you can see up there, actually, I'm backing up more to the Ubuntu cloud. But yeah, a lot of data backed up to the Ubuntu cloud here. I've got um, pictures to my Android devices and a fair amount in my photos album, not my entire photos album, because that's quite large. I've also got like, artwork that I've done, review scores, yeah, I've lost a few of those, it's a bit annoying. But I did a full disk backup on the 11th of June, and the solid state disk died on the 27th, so just over two weeks worth of work lost. A large quantity of my data is on my NAS. That's the custom built NAS I did with Ubuntu Server. RAID 5, hey, if a hard disk blows up on that, it's not completely gone, because I can lose one hard drive as long as I buy another hard drive before it all fails entirely. I can get up and running and keep all the data. So, that's kind of the point of this video. Uh, my favourite programme for doing the backups, Clonezilla, free open source programme, works in, well, works with any operating system that. Backs up to like, a, well you can even do it to a second hard drive, second partition. I did a video on it ages ago, I'm <laughs> not, not happy with it anymore. Uh, that was a very young quid who didn't really know how to screencast properly. Probably doesn't know how to screencast properly now, but <laughs> at least I've got a much larger subscriber count and more positive comments on my videos now, so I must be doing something right. Anyway, that's what I use for doing my backups. I don't do them enough, I should do them more often. But with that, I've just restored to an old hard drive I've got in my system. It's a 500 gig hard drive I use for testing out distros. So really, I didn't lose much in the way of downtime. I've lost a few pictures that I'd drawn, a few scripts that I'd written, and some virtual machines. Really, it's not a huge loss. I also lost a video I'd recorded. I can just re-record that. I haven't lost precious photos and other irreplaceable items like that. So, hey, something to think about. Backups. Cloud storage, Ubuntu One, Apple will do one, don't they? And Microsoft's got their SkyDrive, and there's also Dropbox. Worth using. Oh, just one more thing. I decided to buy another solid state disk today. Uh, I've decided not to buy another OCZ one. They've uh, totally shattered my trust in them. I've actually bought a Samsung 256 gig. I think it was an 840 Pro. So I'll be using that on my main system. My other systems have got OCZ disks in them. But they're not quite so crucial. No. There you are, something to think about. Thanks for watching. See you later.